good. I'm so happy. <laughs> Today I'm gonna to show you how on a very small budget we set up our remote learning station at home. Hi. I was a teacher for almost 10 years, and if you feel overwhelmed by all that's coming up next year, I am so glad you are here. This video is proudly sponsored by Skillshare, so let's get into it. So it's no secret that our playroom has turned into a complete disaster. All right, Charlie. Are you ready? Yeah, let's do it. Hey Owen, how you doing back there? Good. First, the space. We are remote learning this coming school year and both Charlie and I work from home. And this is our upstairs playroom. So we took out the broken train table and rearranged the room to divide it into two functional spaces. <laughs> I got some clearance furniture from Big Lots. It was really affordable. I'll be sure to link down below that I could easily repurpose as a craft table later. Yeah, we're, you know what? This, yeah, we're not. Yeah, okay. No, Owen, go play with the empty box. The Take empty that box. to your brother and you guys make something with that, okay? <laughs> Charlie is hard at work on assembly. I also cleared off this wall so we could decorate it to look like a classroom. Next, I got inspired at the dollar stores and the dollar section at Target. I gave myself a budget of just $15 to decorate and help get us into the mindset of school. That little investment helped us make the best of what we have. I'm loving the motivational sticky quotes for just $3 at Target. You get a bunch of them. And this ABC sign was just a $1 Dollar Tree find. It is for sure a teacher favorite. And I just use $1 poster tack to hang everything on the wall so it's super easy to take down later. I know that the bright colors will help inspire my kids. This is a great find. One of the best ways to help keep your family organized, especially when everybody's at home doing all different things, is a consistent schedule. And I love the Dollar Tree poster strip holders and the organizers for subjects of the day and times to help keep your kids on track. I also pulled a dry erase board from the office downstairs and put it on the wall using Velcro command strips. I also love the Dollar Tree organizing bins. You guys know this, and this makes a perfect way to store all of those items on the shelves. The mini caddies from Dollar Tree are great if you wanna move items around the house. And I love the $3 simple teacher planners that they have in Bullseye's Playground. And if you're on a really small budget, or maybe you don't have a lot of space in your house, I love rolling carts, which you can also pick up at Target. They go on sale all the time, and this is a great way to store all of your supplies and easily hide them away. Next, favorite supplies. Most learning these days is all online anyway, but there's a few essentials not to be missed to work in tandem with what your school is assigning. Dollar Tree stickers are not to be missed, 96 for a dollar. Did you know that the biggest predictor of kids' success is that they feel successful? I think these little rewards help a lot. I love their two minute timers and their foam counting blocks for math. And their dry erase paddles are fantastic for quick games along with their off-brand markers. They are a secret awesome find. Dry erase dice are great for games. And this printable is totally free from doitonadieblog.com. The best deals on all your back to school supplies, whether it's Dollar Tree or Walmart, the best quality so the things will last through the year. Teacher recommended. Target also has a ton of busy box items. One of my favorite scores, that's just $3, are these little magnetic kits. My kids love these. 
Reading is so crucial and it can be really hard to find books on a budget and I have always been impressed by Dollar Tree selection. They have scholastic brand as well as really high quality non-fiction choices. My biggest goals when redoing this space was to have items that could be changed out easily, could be repurposed down the line, and to keep it really simple. That you're here and so grateful to Skillshare for partnering with me on this video. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of inspiring classes for creatives, people without a lot of time and on a really small budget. Whether you're at home more and just need space for self-care and wanna learn a new skill, or maybe you're homeschooling your kids for the first time and want tips and tricks, they are definitely the place to go. In fact, the first thousand people to sign up using my link get two months absolutely free. They have classes for side hustles, like how to grow your presence on Etsy. They have productivity and lifestyle classes, and they're all taught by experts. In fact, one of my favorites is an interior design class by Lauren Cox. It's actually one that I use to help redesign this room when working on scale and balance so we could fit both things in this very awkward space. It's just $10 a month, you can work at your own pace, and I love how succinct and easy to follow the classes are. The link is in my description box so you guys can check it out and start your free trial. In all this crazy, remember to keep it simple and carve out time for you too because you are worth it. I am so grateful to you and that you are here. Be sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already so I can catch you guys in the next video. I love you guys so much and I'll see you then. Bye. 2020 school year. No, I'm doing this too, Audrey. Wow, you can really dance. I'm breaking. <laughs>